This is Braxton Hartle. Braxton. A happy and healthy two-year-old boy. I'm hungry. Can I have a rib? I need a rib. Who loves Batman? His brother. And his cheese pizza. What do you want for lunch today? Yeah. By looking at Braxton today, no one would know what this little superhero has been through. Truly making him a miracle. Oh, good eyebrow. But his journey didn't begin here. It actually goes back to June of 2016 with what they thought was a stomach bug. Went to the hospital here in Clovis and they just thought it was just a, you know, a stomach bug. He uh, got sent home feeling a little better after an IV. <laughs> he uh, helped me wash my pickup, played in the front yard. Everything seemed to be okay for little Braxton, but within a matter of days, he began to decline. Woke up Tuesday morning and he was just lethargic, hardly couldn't keep his head up. And he hadn't peed. Hadn't peed. He just wasn't, wasn't him. The initial results from Braxton's test showed he had Shigella, but after reevaluating, it actually showed he had an E. coli shigatoxin, causing Braxton's kidneys to shut down. Someone else obviously had the bacteria uh, in their stool. And this isn't your normal E. coli bacteria. This is a, a special one that produces a toxin that's um, through the oral route. And that's what got him sick with the diarrhea. And After a 45 minute helicopter ride, Braxton arrived at UMC, where he stayed there for the next 13 days. They start working on him and as soon as we got there, they were you know, you can just tell they were a different class. You know what I mean? It was just, they were there to do a job and they did their job very well. So well that they were able to share special moments like these. <laughs> Doctors at UMC say it was Braxton's parents that spotted it early on that truly makes this a miracle. He's a miracle because, you know, a lot of children die from this. And so if it's not recognized early and treated early and thought about, these children will die. But he didn't thankfully get that sick because we got to him early enough. He did end up needing dialysis and we were able to recover his kidneys um, well enough that he was able to go on and be a normal, happy boy. Which brings us back to the present. Braxton Hartle, a two-year-old miracle boy with his full life ahead of him. Devin Ward, KCBD News Channel 11.